Hi, I'm Lee from Ransom Spares. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to replace the door seal on a washing machine. I'm going to be demonstrating on a Bosch washing machine, but the procedure should be similar no matter what make or model you have. First of all, remember to always unplug the machine from the mains before you attempt to carry out any repairs. On this Bosch washing machine, uh, the front panel can be removed, which gives us great access to replace the door seal. However, on most washing machines, this isn't possible and the door seal replacement is carried out through the front porthole of the machine. We first need to remove the lid of the washing machine. Next, we can remove the front retaining spring which fastens the front part of the door seal to the front panel. We can now peel the front part of the door seal away from the front panel. By tilting the machine back slightly gives us access to two screws that are holding the lower part of the front panel in place. On some Bosch machines it's necessary to remove the dispenser drawer so that we can gain access to a screw that holds the top of the front panel to the main casing of the machine. This one is not necessary then. The front panel should now pull away from the machine by um, the bottom coming away and then just slightly pulling the, the front down and away. What we need to do now is remove the retaining spring that's holding the door seal onto the outer tub. Now because we can take the front panel off on this machine it makes life a lot easier because we can remove this counterweight which will give us access to it. On machines where you can't remove the front panel it's still a fairly straightforward job. There's more room to get to the retaining spring and what you would do you'd remove the lid and then you'd remove the retaining spring which is normally held in place with a screw that untightens it that you can then remove from the top. You can then do the replacement through the main front porthole but we're going to remove the counterweight so that we can get to the retaining spring on this machine. We can now peel away the old door seal from the outer tub. Just remember before we do that that just note the orientation of the door seal for when we replace it with a new one. There's three holes down the bottom. Just before we replace the new door seal, just make sure that round the tub where the new door seal is going to sit, it's nice and clean just by wiping it down with a, with a damp cloth just to remove any um, residue that's still there. So with the new door seal positioned correctly, i.e. the three holes down at the bottom, we now need to feed the new door seal over the lip of the outer tub. And it's quite straightforward, it can be a little bit fiddly, but once you get going, it is quite easy. Okay, now we need to replace the retaining spring. The best way to do this when it is actually a spring, sometimes it's a band that you wrap around and then fasten from the top with a screw. But when it's a spring, the best way to do it is to fold the door seal into the machine, out of the way. Now 
reconnect the spring so it's one piece and then fit it into the recess that it goes in to hold the seal onto the tub. Make sure that it's seated correctly. With the front panel replaced, we now need to feed the, the lip of the new door seal, the outer door seal, onto the front panel of the machine. We now need to refit the front retaining band onto the door seal. And we do that just by placing the band in place and then sometimes we just need to finish it off with a pair of long nose pliers just to open up the spring and ensure that the, the band is fully fitted. Refit the lid. So there you go, that's how you replace the door seal on a washing machine. Remember door seals and all other washing machine spares can be found on the Ransom Spares website. Thanks for watching.